In recent weeks, Hybe has been embroiled in a series of sticky situations, including claims of membership with the cult Dan World. Fan-generated evidence circulated quickly online, convincing the public that the label incorporates cult-related patterns and concepts into the projects of its performers, including BTS. While Hybe has yet to issue an official statement on the matter, Dan World did so on May 1, 2024. They categorically denied any involvement with Hybe. Amid the investigation into the truth between entertainment firm Hybe and Adore CEO Min Hee Jin, yoga organization Dan World has become embroiled in a related scandal. We want to make it clear that the dispute surrounding Dan World is absolutely fake. We will take severe legal action against the distribution of bogus news about Dan World, which causes defamation, business interruption, and financial losses. This reaction barely halted the internet wildfire of allegations for a brief while. As a major YouTube channel brought it up again, this time with supposed video evidence. On May 2, the YouTube channel Hoverlab broadcast a lengthy live stream in an attempt to prove that high band BTS are truly tied to Dan World. Netizens appear to have picked up on two specific segments from this webcast both of which feature Lee Sung Hyun, the creator of Dan World. The first footage, from 2018, shows Lee thanking BTS members who have registered as students at Global Cyber University, GCU. Lee is the university's founder and chancellor, or president, as he referred to himself in tweets. In this film, Lee is heard asserting that the BTS members are learning brain education, much like the other kids at the school. Brain education is a core term in Lee's cult, referring to his teachings that said that once his followers harnessed enough energy through this process, they would fly to an enlightenment star aboard a spaceship shaped like a golden turtle. The second clip in question introduced Hybe into the picture. The channel's owner, Kim Seui, stated that the company's name varies from the standard spelling of Hive, since it is an abbreviation for Dan World. Lee commended BTS's message of love yourself, love myself, and encouraged supporters to include heal yourself, brain education into their life. Kim said that Hive is an abbreviation for this exact statement. Coincidentally, Barely a year after the video was first published, Big Hit Music trademarked the name Hybe. Despite the fact that the multi-label organization officially launched in 2021, it should be noted, however, that the video snippets given by the station as evidence are of low quality. There is a significant degree of latency in the visuals, to the point that it appears like the audio is combined on top of a static image. Even among netizens, the channel does not appear to have a trustworthy reputation, which has left them on the fence concerning these claims. Wow. It appears like the dogs are out to get them. Lol. Lee Sung Hyun himself explained the concept of Hive. The source is Hoverlab's live feed. Today, the fact that Hoverlab unearthed this is amazing. I fucking detest Hoverlab. However, no one comes close to them in terms of courage. They began broadcasting on YouTube when the media was reluctant to report. Eventually, they discovered something noteworthy. But honestly, how did they discover this? If Hive has no ties to Dan World, they should sue them after watching this video. Right? But why are only BTS reps threatening to take action over Sajayagi and cult associations? Whatever is going on, it's fishy AF. Hoverlab on YouTube. Though, can we trust them? Quote. 